Hey guys, this is Raven here, and uh, I just caught a shiny Charmander um, out in the wild, and it, it took me quite a couple tries. <laughs> As you'll see right now, um, I was about to make the video, but you see that my catch combo is 241, and uh, I just got my shiny Charmander. Now, I'm going to show you how I did that. Um, because there's, uh, I've been watching uh, YouTube videos and I've been uh, looking at some different posts that people have made. And of course, this game is new. People are still trying to figure out uh, what does what and uh, how to make things happen. But I'm going to show you my method and uh, what I did. And I really haven't seen any videos or anything on any kind of forum uh, saying that this is possible. I may be wrong. I mean, uh, I didn't look, you know, too far uh, anywhere. But as you see, um, the Charmanders are just spawning, and uh, I'm oh, oops. gonna use a different ball here because uh, that ball I'm just gonna just gonna use those balls for my 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 team, my PVP team. So to show you that um, my combo's still here and my combo's uh, still going on i'll just go ahead and catch this charmander real quick i think at the very beginning oh he's gonna run away so i'm just gonna run so another thing is uh, they do a specific animation uh of course they do a specific animation when they're about to run and you'll know it um that charmander just sort of kind of lunges at you and it, and it uh, with like both of his arms ahead of him that's how you'll know and you can see their animations um, in the in the pokedex so and there's other videos about it as well so that's it's not a big deal actually you should you should be able to see a catch combo in the beginning of the fight catch combo should come up here but i just wanted to catch one for you guys um just see that it spawns um and i'll show you how i got them to spawn like this because normally if you start a catch combo um, let's see, there it is, 242, and that's how long it took me just to get my shiny Charmander, and I was here forever. Um, so anyways, now that I'm done with Charmander, I, I can even show you all the candies that I got, um, from all this, the, all the Charmanders. <coughs> there it is. So, there's my Charmander candy. I, yeah, so, in order to get Charmander candy, you just have to catch a lot of stuff. Um, so of course, this is legit, um, this is a legit way to do it. So, um, also one thing before I go ahead and, uh, show you guys that there's also something that I, um, noticed a lot, uh, about, uh, like what, what not to do or, or like what cuts the combo. Um, one thing that people say that cuts the combo is turning off the game but that's not completely true um because i'm gonna go ahead and turn off the game right now so i have a catch, catch combo right now i'm gonna go ahead and just turn off the game there it is i turned off the game now i'm gonna turn it back on and hey i'm still here well, let me save this real quick because i got my terminator I'm still here, and I'll go ahead and uh, get a Charmander. And my cash combo is still there. There's my catch combo. So turning off the game doesn't actually reset your catch combo. What does though, is if you go into the menu and turn it off here, and you turn it off and you close it here. Um, you don't wanna do that. Because if you do that, then it resets. But if you turn off your game with power off, it doesn't, it, it just doesn't. Um, so actually real quick, I'll probably cut this out um, because I want to also try to catch, um, a shiny Mewtwo. So every time I get a combo, uh, over 31, um, I'm gonna go 
try to catch Mewtwo real quick. So, before I explain <laughs> how I did the Charmander thing, I'm going to go ahead and try to catch Mewtwo, and then I'll, I'll go ahead and explain how uh, I, I got the Charmander to uh, catch combo so high. So, I'm going to go ahead and save this. And <clears throat> fly over here. Alright, so that's another thing. Um catching catching this Mewtwo. Um and catching a shiny Mewtwo. Uh, a lot of people suggest to uh, soft reset, and I think that's that by far with the math that is the best method. Um, you can probably turn on a lure, make sure you have your shiny charm, and just stand right up to Mewtwo and reset it. And um, I think you like just like that, you'll have uh, I believe like a, a thousand. At least a, a thousand chance one in a thousand chance to catch him um, just with that alone without any catch combos um, because if you get a catch combo and then you have to come all the way down here just to battle Mewtwo that's just gonna take up a lot more of your time so the best way I mean even though it's better odds like my odds right now with my combo um, is uh, I, I think like 300 it's a little under 300 it's uh, 273 I believe um, so 1 in 273 that's what my odds right now are um, of catching a shiny Mewtwo and hopefully I, I do that but I promise myself every time I um, do a catch combo of 31 and I'm gonna you know get rid of my catch combo I'm gonna go here just to see if I can get a, uh, a shiny Mewtwo um, so I'm gonna go ahead and make sure my party I can defeat him with that small X up here all right I'm just gonna try it out and if not I'll just reset the game and let's see if uh, we get a shiny me too and that would be amazing if I did but uh, I don't think I'm going to and no I did not okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, soft reset the game and I'll show you guys how I uh, how I did that so this is one thing that um, if you go out in the wild and you try to catch like a Charmander or a Bulbasaur or uh, I think it's just the 1% most um, Pokemon is the Charmander, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, I think um, Dragonite and I think there's a, a few others I think there's a Porygon as well um, and uh, I think Scyther, Scyther as well um, so there's a couple of Pokemon that are 1% that don't really show up on the map um, all that often. So they will start showing up once you get a catch combo of 11. So, I mean, they, they do show up, I guess, if you don't have a catch combo, but it's really rare. But it, once you hit that magic mark of 11, then they'll start showing up on, in the world. Um, and they'll only show up one at a time. Uh, so... One thing that I've noticed is if you go to the uh, to the go part and you have transferred over some Pokemon, you can catch those and that will start your catch combo. So what you can do is uh, if you have a lot of um, extra Pokemon, which I've been doing actually, there, there was a, a sort of a kind of an event in Pokemon Go where there's a lot of uh, Charmanders, Bulbasaurs, and Squirtles, and Dragon Knights all popping out in the last two three days. Uh, unfortunately that's over but let's say you, you you have some of those in your Pokemon Go and you know you just just transfer them over. Just transfer them over you know to the game and, uh, <laughs> and you can start a catch combo. Um, so let's go into the park and we'll enter, this is where I have um, have them all. Now there won't be any Charmanders because I caught them all. I had 11 exactly. Um, <laughs> so I had 11 Charmanders exactly. 
So I started the cat combo and then I went down there and, and then I continued it. So here are all my, my Pokemon uh, from Pokemon Go. Um, so I can go ahead and, and just start catching them. Um, it's just that easy. It just start catching them and start the combo here. And then when you go out in the in the actual the game world uh, to try to catch these out in the in the wild, they'll they'll be there and they'll be there consistently. So you'll just um, you'll just be catching them like normal. So just start it um, at eleven. Just start, just start your combo here at to, up to 11, and then just go out and start catching them in the wild. So you'll see right now, I'll just catch a couple. Um, I won't make this video too long, but take my word for it. This is how I did it, and uh, this is how it's done. So I just caught my first one. Of course, it's not going to say catch combo or anything, but I just catch my first one. So now I'll catch my next one. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this with all the Pokemon that I have in here. Um, and I'll, I'll have them all shiny um, pretty soon. Um, this is great. So, you know, just let everybody know about this. Um, here you'll see Cash Combo 2. Let, let everybody know about this. Um, yeah, Cash Combo 2. Keep it up. So, you know, this, you can start your combo this way and then you you go out and you, <laughs> where these spawn one at a time and you just catch them one at a time <laughs> so that's that's basically it um i'm, I'm gonna try to make this just I'm, i'll probably just cut it off here um because you know this is this works. You see the catch combo uh, adding up there. So once you do that, you'll just exit and then start catching them out um, out in the wild. Uh, so this works. It's a proven method. I just did it with my Charmander. Um, have guys, good luck shiny hunting. Um, like like I said, just you know, just use uh, Pokemon Go to your advantage, um, like I did, and uh, transfer you know all the Pokemon that are one percent. To your game and just uh, start your combo and then um, continue it out in the wild and uh, catch your shiny um, it took me a while um, not gonna lie because you know it still um, I think it was like 220 30 something um, but I finally caught my Charmander <laughs> my shiny Charmander and um, and he's he's timid as well make sure you change um, make sure you change that before you start all this combo uh, chaining. Um, just make sure everything is the way that you want it. Uh, and, and just good luck, you guys. Good luck, uh, shiny, shiny um, hunting. Uh, good luck and uh, nice, nice chatting with you guys. And uh, I'll see you guys next video. Um, peace out. This is Raven. Thank you for watching.